In this MapSuite MVC sample app walkthrough, we're going to show you how you can create a Graticule adornment layer for your application. If you're not familiar with what Graticules are, you'll see on the sample app here we've got uh, basically some squares overlaying the map with, um, or a grid I should say, and each one of them is labeled with the, uh, the different degrees of longitude and latitude. Uh, so Graticules, typically the way they work is you zoom in you'll start getting smaller and smaller units so now you can see there's only two degrees difference where if I zoom out you know there was 10 degrees so Graticules typically um, adjust you know based on the scale of your map to give your user a good representation of where they are in the coordinate system so let's take a look at the code of how you can set up uh, a Graticule adornment layer and in this sample pretty much all the codes here in the view source so we've got our standard code where we're just adding the map to the page and setting up the world map kit background. And then we're creating a Graticule adornment layer. And in this situation, we're actually going to set the Graticule text brush to give it that uh, kind of blue uh, or navy, I should say, and uh, white effect that you saw on the outside of the map there for the degrees uh, textile. Um, and then just simply add the uh, Graticule adornment layer to the to whatever overlay you would like. Typically you want to add it last since it will be drawn on top of everything. And we also recommend putting in a single tile um, so because of some performance gains of doing the tiles accordingly and then also to make sure that your uh, labels don't get cut off on the tile borders. And then finally we're rendering the map out. So in addition to just setting the text brush, um, if you look out on our wiki here, the Graticule adornment layer has also the line style that you can change and modify to however you'd like your line style to look. The font, so if you don't like the font that's being used for the, uh, the labeling on the Graticule adornment layer, you can control all of that, along with uh, several other properties here. So if, uh, um, if you're looking to add Graticules, this is a great tool um, to use because it's pretty simple to set up and it handles uh, a lot of different scenarios. I hope this sample app walkthrough has been helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us, or you can post them directly on our discussion forums at gis.thinkgeo.com forums. Thank you for watching.